Tony Parker may be an old man, but that doesn't mean H.E. is still not a coveted free agent. As the 36-year-old enters free agency and prepares for a possible life after the San Antonio Spurs, two teams are reportedly interested in the former NBA Finals MVP. According to Lequa Ph. T. Simmons Stefan of Basketusa.com and Paul Garcia Projectspurs.com, both the Denver Nuggets and Charlotte Hornets are among the five or six teams interested in the 17-year veteran. Through the first the day of free agency, there weren't any rumors about where Parker might play, but, according to Basketusa.com by Lequa P. Parker has five to six teams with interest in him, specifically the Denver Nuggets and Charlotte Hornets. The Nuggets are interested in Parker because they need a veteran to back up young guards Jamal Murray and Gary Harris. They're a borderline playoff team, having finished as the ninth-best team in the Western Conference the past couple of OFS. Adding a guy like Parker, who has played in the playoffs every year of his 17-year career, could be the difference between the Nuggets making the playoffs and not making it. Denver also traded Wilson Chandler to the Philadelphia 76ers and cleared up cap space in the process no pun intended. As far as the Hornets are concerned, one can assume new head James Borrego has a lot to do with the team's interest in Parker. Borrego coached Parker as the assistant head coach of the Spurs for the past three years, so HES pretty darn familiar with what Parker brings to the table. While the veteran guard may no longer be a starter and may be on his last legs, he can still be a contributor off of the bench and in a mentorship role. He has also reiterated that he has no plans of retiring and wants to play three more years to reach the 20-season milestone mark. Parker lost his starting job to Dejounte Murray midway through the, which was the first time that he had come off of the bench in his career. He had been the starting point guard for the Spurs since his rookie in 2001-02. The French point guard averaged 7.7 .7 points and 3.5 assists in just a shade under 20 minutes per game last. They were the worst marks of his career. It remains to be seen whether or not the Spurs bring Parker back, but it's clear that they do want him back, as long as the numbers make sense, according to Michael C. Wright of ESPN. Oh yeah, Tony Parker is out there too as a FA. His people are out shopping for a deal, I'm told. Spurs would still like him back in a mentorship role if the numbers work for both sides. We'll see if the Spurs can make the numbers work, because if they can't, the Hornets or the Nuggets will.